Hello again, YouTube. So somebody asked, how can I do the subdrop thing with Cubase? And uh, I noticed that it wasn't as easy with Cubase, but you can still do it. So what you need to do is that you need to create a new input that isn't connected anywhere. Then route that into your channel. Then record the short clip of silence. And then you go to audio, uh, plugins, tools, test generator. Use the sine wave, 80 hertz minus 12 dB. And after that, what you do is you go to file, process, pitch shift. And it normally looks like this. And then you go to envelope, click here, take the thing down. Set the range to 16 and click process. Now it sounds similar what we got with Pro Tools, except it doesn't have the fade out. So what you want to do now is, if you want to keep it like that, that's okay. But you can also go audio, process, fade out. And click preview. Now it's similar what we had in Pro Tools. If you want to have more sustain, click this kind of curve. But I prefer that this curve. Okay, click process. And after that, go to plugins, base, max base. And then we use the same settings, max base to zero. Click process and then process, normalize to minus one, process, and we are done. And then what you need to do is go to audio, bounce, selection. And now we have a new subdrop file in our folder. I uh, hope you found this tutorial interesting. Thank you for watching and make good music. Ask um, about the uh